What's up, guys? Good morning. It's another day. Yay. Squilliam. 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 I turned the heat press on. Uh, are you really wanting to? Let's get some t-shirts going, Bob. Uh -huh. Woo! Get them done, babe. So yeah, today is going to be another busy, productive day. Day nine. <laughs> but soon we'll be done. Woo! I think I'm running out to get some coffee. Coffee sound good? Yeah. You need some coffee? I don't know it's a Starbucks bull crap you be drinking. <laughs> I don't know if it's a Starbucks. I like that stuff from Walmart, boy. Uh, so yeah, today the goal is to get all these hoodies packed up, folded, ready to go, and then I think tomorrow morning we're going to start packaging up orders to send out on Monday morning uh, for you guys. So if you bought and pre-ordered a t-shirt or hoodie from nosleepteam.com, it should be sending out uh, on Monday morning. Hopefully. Some of them at least. Uh, majority of the orders we're going to try to get done by then. Hopefully. Uh, all of them. Alyssa! She, I don't think she can hear. Alyssa! My foot's asleep. Can I move the blanket a little bit? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's beautiful, Molly! Oh, <laughs> Hey, buddy, you're awake. Look at you. Hey, great. You say it's cold? No, that's just my heart towards women. <laughs> it's official. I'm tired of the cold weather. Yep, I'm done with it. Not, I'm not tired of it, but uh, I'm getting there. Because I'm already sick of my hands being freezing cold. Like, I can't hardly move my hands right now. It, like, if I wanted to type on a keyboard right now, it's really hard. I have to get my hands warm first. Uh, my mom, my grandma, like we're all like that, uh, where our hands don't have good blood circulation, so they stay cold. Uh, when they get cold, it's hard to use them. It makes me hate winter. My feet are the same way too, like, and that makes it harder to skate when it's cold. Like my toes feel like almost numb. Like I can't really control what I'm doing. Your toes, believe it or not, can control a lot of skateboarding. Uh, and yeah, it messes up my flicks and stuff like that until I get my feet warm. I literally have to get warmed up before I can skate good when it's cold going out to do some errands gotta get some stuff done today you know what i hate when people don't freaking use a turn signal when they're supposed to just flick your hand like that quit being lazy <laughs> ties rants so i just went to the post office and they were closed right when i got there yay now i gotta go to another one which i think will be open and if not, I'll just wait there because it'll be open in a few minutes. All right, so as I'm like getting stuff done today, and I do this every day, I make a to-do list, whether it's on my phone uh, or on a board like we used to do. We, we'd write on our little whiteboard or whatever. Um, I have to have a to-do list, so I, or even if I'm not following it, just to get it out of my head and know everything that I need to do, even if I'm not going to do it for a long time. Uh, I don't know if you guys are that way, but I want to know, actually, what are the ways that you organize your life. Like when you got a lot of stuff to do, especially if you're a business owner, like you own your own business, uh, you work for yourself, you're an entrepreneur or whatever, uh, what are your ways to organize your life and how do you do it? Leave some comments down below. I'm interested to know because I could apply that to my life and you guys could read each other's comments and maybe uh, get some organization tips from each other too. As far as my to-do list, I'll use the Reminders app, uh, which this is my to-do list today, which I can go ahead and start marking stuff off. I went by recycling, got me some Starbucks. Yes, that's on my to-do list. Just I, I, I'm super OCD about I'm like alright I've got to do this I'm putting in my to-do list just because it gives me another thing to check off it makes me feel good to check stuff off my to-do list dang it I can't check it off if it keeps trying to write it alright I'm gonna call some people I'm gonna work on some videos and yeah lots of stuff to do Ta-da! chicken alright I need something to grab it where's the thing girl got it I got it got it got it Pull this chicken out the oven. Hopefully, I don't burn myself. So we got some buffalo. We got some regular chicken. Oh, freaking! About to make a mess. We got some tater tots. I think those are okay to sit there. Ah, uh, boy, you ready to eat? Yeah, folks. Yeah. Who doesn't freaking love tater tots? Like, if you don't like tater tots, something is wrong with you. And if you haven't tried tater tots. They are like the better version of fries. So you know the crispy, amazing, delicious part that's around the outside of fries? Well, a tater tot is like a smaller version of a fry. So in every bite, you're getting all crispy around the outside. And it's really small, and you can have like a bunch of them, and it's all crispy in your mouth. It's delicious. There's a certain type of people who don't like it. What? 
there's a certain type of people who don't like tater tots. I know, and those certain type of people they're are wrong. Com- they're called communists. <laughs> oh, yeah. Gotta get that dunk in that ketchup. Stealing bodies, mm. aliens, and bringing the dead back So back. freaking good. Could have made them crispier, but I ain't complaining. Just watching me eat all the time in the vlogs make you guys hungry. In case he starts screaming and you need to hold I'm sorry. Hey right, guys, we're gonna mess with Squall. He's out there in the garage uh, pressing shirts. I'm gonna go outside, kind of sit there, and then just start laughing. And he's gonna think that something is actually up or I did something, and I haven't done anything. So it's gonna be hilarious. Squall! Squall! <laughs> William. This is up. All right. You vote me an extra time. You're one up on me. You are one up on me. Hey. We made a truce today that we wouldn't poke it's each other. Then I poked him. You, I, no, whatever. I poked him twice on accident because hey. I forgot. Now he's hey. one up on me. I got one poke on you now. You poked me three times. I poked you twice. Distraction. <laughs> Pack them hoodies, girl. Get it. We're done. I'm kidding. My shoestring is shredding. Look at this. It's everywhere. Look at that, Mac. My shoestring is going crazy. Yeah. Bag. Bag. Oh, sit. Bag. Bag. That's so cute. Bag. Oh, gosh. You're so cute. Smack his booty. Woo. It is chilly out here. Way too chilly for a tank top right now. Look at this. Don't these clouds look like snow clouds? Just like white, puffy. I don't know. It smells like it could snow right now. It's not cold enough to snow, but it, it's pretty chilly. Hank. Mac just sniffing around the yard. He likes his dog over here. He actually pretends to hate it. He barks at it all the time. Every time he goes out, if this dog's out here, he barks at it. And he he's like, is it over there? Nope, it's not Mac. He'll be, he be fussing at you too. Yeah, it's, it's really his friend. They're best friends. They just don't know it. Hey, man. <laughs> 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 God dang it! <laughs> Open the door! Get him back! <laughs> hey! Uh huh. Get on my face. Hey, ball. Hey, ball. Quit. Didn't make a poop. Well, every time I'm telling you, I cannot vlog without poop being mentioned. Quit. All right, guys. So it's been a while since we've done a Q and A in the vlog. No more poking. We we we're gonna do a Q and A. Uh, me and Squall. I just tweeted it out. Wait, don't read the questions. Uh, I've got five questions. Me and Squall are gonna answer them. You guys have tweeted us. Uh, so here we go. Let's do this. All right. First question is from Mark. And he says, how did you and Squall meet? Uh, it's called when he was born. We're cousins. Yeah. Se- second cousin. He's my second back. cousin. My dad's uh, first cousin. And his dad is 10 years older than me. We're not the same age. <laughs> I'm 10 years older than him, and his dad's 10 years older than me. <laughs> so that's how he met, when I was born, I guess. <laughs> Preston. Squall! Yeah, I came out going, Squall! He come out, he had this whole cone head. I did. I said, Mom, that's an ugly baby. <laughs> she said, I know, but anyways. Yeah. But it turned out all right. Preston asked, what is your best moment in life and describe it? I'm going to uh, mention the moment we were just talking about when I was born. That was a, that was a great moment in history. I'm no, just kidding. Worst day of my life. <laughs> I'd say every day. Every day is a freaking journey. I love it. Watch a garden, dig it. <laughs> Sandre, hopefully I'm saying your name right, says, or this is for Squall actually, says, Squall, how is it working for Ty? <laughs> if it 
work just saving before? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. See, like, we've all had that DH boss in life. But you can't do this to him. <laughs> Go ahead. That's good. We'll get along with him. Yeah. Josh asked, I thought you were about to poke me. <laughs> Josh asked, if you could have any super ability, uh, what would it be? Mine, I think it may be like the ability to either like teleport or be invisible. Because if you could be invisible, it'd be pretty fine with most people. I'm straight flying. Super flying. Style. Oh, yes. Teleporting would be better than flying, though. No, you could just be like, I'm right there. Do you know how many dreams I've had my entire life? Like, literally, when I was a kid, I can remember flying around Toys R Us. Like, looking, oh, yeah. Looking, at, looking down on toys. <laughs> I've always dreamed about flying. Oh, I've, I've had dreams where I've been flying, and like, I'm like, oh my god, I'm flying right now, and I'm dreaming. And I'll just I'll fly around, lucid dreaming. Is that the one you told me about where you messed your pants? And no, you I don't, to, don't think so. <laughs> you woke up scared. And it was a dream, anyways, if I did. Well, you woke up and they're dirty. <laughs> no, that's completely <laughs> fake. All right, and the last question, Ricardo, have you ever gotten into a fist fight at school? I've gotten into a couple. Mm -hmm. uh, one time, I think I told this story, I punched a kid playing basketball, punched him in the nose because he kept fouling me really hard. And I was like, you do that again, you get punched, and he got punched. That's pretty much it. Man, a lot of violent questions, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think everybody's got a fist fight. Not everybody, but most people. We're from a little redneck town. That's what people do. We grew out of that, thank God. But, yeah. I, I never really got in that many fist fights. Maybe like two or three. That's about it. Kid threw a handful of freaking glass at me. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Wait, what did you do to make him throw glass at you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's See, the question. I was a mean little kid. <laughs> <laughs> See, I knew there was somebody. <laughs> so he got his butt whooped in. Probably got made fun of before that. But he threw glass at me. It's dangerous. Words aren't dangerous. All right, guys. There you go. There's five questions. With the Squallawalla Ding Dong. <laughs> Another name. Squib, squib, squeak, squib, squib, scrinkle. Why not take a toss? Scrinkle. Scrunchy. Why did I just make it up this morning? Using S words. Hey. <laughs> Squelmus. Squelmus. Oh. Look at this. Gray's folding. Mama's packing. Helping us out. Thank you. Really packing. Getting these hoodies done. I'm actually about to sit over here and custom designs. And yeah, that's what we're doing on a Thursday night. That's, that's how we spend our time. Oh yeah. Just having a blast right now. Turn up. Turn down. The <laughs> 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 Alright guys, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. If you enjoyed it, go ahead and click the like button down below and subscribe to our YouTube channel. We post videos Monday through Friday, so you don't miss any of them. I'll see you guys on Monday. Peace.